Hello! Today, I'll guide you step by step on how to set up and use the Braille keyboard on a Samsung device. First, make sure TalkBack is enabled as this keyboard is only usable while it is on. This feature can be found in Settings, Accessibility, TalkBack, then toggle the switch to on. Selected. Accessibility. Interaction and Dexterity. TalkBack 3 of 14. TalkBack. Navigate up button out of list. Double to set up the Braille keyboard, open settings. Settings in pager with connections. Settings. Digital well-being and battery and device. Tap general. General management. Selected. Then keyboard, keyboard list, list in default. default. In here, enable keyboard talkback braille keyboard. Samsung keyboard English US 3 of 10 in list 10 items. Top back braille keyboard for Make 10. sure keyboard button on navigation bar is also enabled. When typing, a keyboard switch or button will appear in the navigation bar navigation at the bottom bar. of your device. Tapping Double it will bring up a menu in which you can Double find and Samsung select the braille setting. keyboard. Not checked radio button top back braille keyboard. When the six dots appear on screen, you can Swipe use your fingers, fingers to type in braille options. on the display like you would on a braille display. Swipe up with two fingers to bring up the braille keyboard settings menu where you can review gestures, open the keyboard tutorial, item. or enter the braille keyboard review settings. Gestures. Double tap to act. Open tutorial. Settings. Cancel button. Swipe right or left to make a space or delete a character, or use two new fingers line. to make a new line or delete, delete a word line. or empty line. Move your cursor by character SYB, forward and tap, back by swiping up tap, and down with one SYB. finger. Dismiss the keyboard with a two finger swipe down or switch keyboards with a three finger swipe Editing. down. Hello, this is a demo of the top back braille keyboard on my Samsung Tab S5. And that's how to use the braille keyboard for talkback on an Android device.